I was so excited that Sephora had this. I thought for sure they were never gonna do the other palettes, but it's the Toki Doki eyeshadow palette. And this one, I think it's called like um, 24 Karat is the name of it. I'm not sure about that. But there are these really tiny little eyeshadow palettes, smaller than the Stila palettes and thinner than the Stila palettes. They're made out of the cardboard, kind of just like those little Stila travel palettes. It tells you what colors are on the back. It does not name them, it just shows you what they look like. But I love all the little cartoon details. And these are actually perfect, perfect, perfect for in a purse, for travel. I mean, they're such a great size. So this has a little mirror here, and it comes with a blush, and then four eyeshadows. So I'll do swatches for you here. Ooh, really pretty blue color. Wow, that's nice. They're kind of silky, really nice and creamy. This black one, it's kind of similar to, oh, I don't know, this year I feel like a lot of different companies came out with a black like this, even Wet n Wild. But it's a black base eyeshadow and then the glitter is different. This silver one is coming off a little bit harder. It's kind of like a chunky glitter silver. So it's hard to kind of get the chunks to kind of really settle into the skin there. It's leaving more of a silver sheen than anything. And then a nice kind of shimmery white. Now they do all have a decent amount of glitter to them. The white is more of a shimmer. It's a little bit kind of cakey though. It's um, I don't, I don't love pure white eyeshadows. I like ivories kind of off-white. This silver you see here, it's kind of hard to get it to show up because it's really more kind of a chunky silver. This blue is gorgeous, super silky, it's really creamy, really easy, and then the black is great too. And if you can kind of see, it has like silver and blue sparkle in it, where the blue is really more of a shimmer, and then the silver, it comes off as a shimmer even though it's kind of textured like a chunky. So these are the eyeshadows, kind of side by side, kind of see, really pretty blue color. And then this is what the blush looks like, kind of a shocking pink, really, really vibrant pink color, which I think, you know, maybe with a brush and everything, you would have a better time of blending that out. But that might end up looking a little bit too 80s for my taste. But if anything, you could use it as an eyeshadow. It's so pigmented. So that's the blush and the shadows. And this is the Tokidoki Art Palette. And this is the 24 Karat.